Hey guys, this is now on MA to show you how you can downgrade from 3.1.3 to 3.1.2. And this is only for the iPod Touch, I repeat. This is only for the iPod Touch. And because when you update your iPhone, it will update your baseband. And you can't downgrade an updated baseband. So this will only work for an iPod Touch. I am 90 to 100% sure this will work. What, and what you're going to need to have is the 3.1.2 firmware for your device which I have right here so have this on your desktop ready for use alright so you accidentally updated to 3.1.3 in this video I'll show you how you can downgrade and let's update first and again if you update it will erase all your jailbreak data I am currently jailbroken on my iPod touch CD is right there Currently jailbroken, so if I update, all my jailbreak data will be gone. So let's continue. And the bug, it's only bug fixes, guys. It's nothing really that fancy. You don't need to update if you care that much about jailbreaking. You really don't need to update. Um, let's continue. Agree. And it is downloading the iPod Touch software update. I'll be back when it's finished downloading, guys. The software and getting ready to update my iPod Touch to 3.1.3. Um, it should take about five minutes at the most. It's going actually pretty fast. Impressive how fast it is going. Maybe it's that new iTunes. Well, iTunes just updated me to 3.1.3. Um, took about five minutes. Uh, and let's downgrade now. So what you're gonna need to do to downgrade is to back up all your data. Um, once you're on iTunes, just uh, right click on your on your device's name and back up so the next thing you need to do is to put your device into the FU mode so hold power button and the home button down and this will erase everything guys so that's why you backed up everything so you can put everything back on your iPod touch so let's hold the power and home button down Oops, it's gonna be hard. All right. Just keep holding it, guys. All right. It's done. And your iPod Touch is in the a few mode. All right, just click OK. So once you get this message, everything is fine. And now, you're going to need to shift, shift, and click on Restore. So just shift and click on Restore, and go to your desktop. That's the place I saved my 3.1.2 firmware. So it's right here. Double click on it and restore. And I should be back on 3.1.2. And we'll be back once this is done. You should get this message. And your device, your iPod Touch, should be on 3.1.2. Let's let it load up here. And it wants me to connect to iTunes. So if iTunes doesn't pop up automatically, you can disconnect and reconnect. Okay. iTunes will pop up any minute. And you should be on 3.1.2. And you can now jailbreak using black rain using the amazing black rain because it is really amazing guys 3.1.2 there you have it guys and I think this is the first video on YouTube showing you how you can downgrade from 3.1.3 to 3.1.2 please rate it 5 stars I came up with this theory myself and it worked so pretty cool thanks for watching please comment rate and subscribe peace